Hey guys, welcome back to another Power Hour. You guys have been loving these, so let's get started. I've got my list written out here on my phone. I highly recommend getting a list together before you get started. And I'm gonna go ahead and start my timer for one hour exactly today and see how much I can get done. I am going to start by gathering all of the little area rugs in the bathrooms and by the doors and throw those in the washing machine and let them wash because you can wash them and this gets them a lot cleaner than just like shampooing them or whatever, however you might be doing it now. You can just throw them in the washing machine. You can let them air dry. I usually will just throw them in the dryer and that's been fine too. If you're worried about it, just let them air dry, but they almost always come out looking brand new. So I'm going to go ahead and throw those in to get started. Started. And then the next thing I'm going to do is go ahead and open my blinds, get that sunlight in, and make my bed. This is a great place to start. If you don't know where to start, start a little laundry and make your bed. Let's get started. Oh, she's sweet but a psycho, a little bit psycho. At night she's screaming, I'm on my mind, out my mind. Oh, she's hot but a psycho, so left but she's right though. At night she's screaming, I'm on my mind, out my mind. Okay, and the next thing I'm gonna quickly do is go into my daughter's room and do the same thing. Just open the blinds, let that sunlight in, and tidy up and make her bed. If you have a robot vacuum, this is the perfect time to use those bad boys. These help me so much when I've got so much that I wanna get done and I don't wanna spend a lot of time on the floors, I just let these loose. So I'm letting this one go and he's gonna do all of the floors for me upstairs. Okay, I've got a load of laundry going. I've got a couple beds made and tidied up in there and now I've moved downstairs and I'm gonna do the same thing with the living room. I'm just tidying up, tidying up the blankets, picking up the toys, putting everything where it goes. This really doesn't take much time at all. Okay, so I've got my robot vacuum going downstairs. This one mops and vacuums, which is great because I've got tons of hard flooring down here. So I'm gonna let that go and I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. So I'm just unloading everything really fast, putting it away and then going to reload it and just wipe down the counters in the kitchen. Again, this doesn't take much time at all. You guys could do it, set those timers. It will motivate you. See if you can beat the clock, see how much you can get done in only one hour. You will be so proud of yourself when you are done, I promise you. And if you do this, give yourself a huge pat on the back from me and from yourself you deserve it because these double as a workout you've got this it doesn't take that much time to clean you too can maintain a clean home if you just implement these tips and tricks that I am trying to share with you here on my channel and show you how really quickly it is to just get things done how it really only takes about an hour out of your day and you can really keep your house in tip-top shape and keep it tidy for the most part if you just do this every single day what well, not every single day but you know what I mean as many days out of the week as you possibly can if you can just set a timer for an hour and tackle those to-do lists then you will be able to maintain a clean home
I'm going to take a break in my kitchen cleaning here to introduce you to my friend Tiffany who has a YouTube channel as well and she does like grocery hauls over there. I know a lot of you love that because you love seeing what others get for their groceries each week. She does those. They're budget friendly as well and then she also does cooking videos and I know you guys like that as well. We all need dinner ideas all of the time and she has got you covered over on her channel. I'm going to let her introduce herself in this next clip so you can see who she is but I'll have her channel linked for you in the description box and you should definitely head over there let her know where you came from say hello and hopefully you will like her channel and subscribe and support her as well and hopefully she will help inspire you when it comes to cooking and getting groceries for the week so I've got you covered when it comes to cleaning and she's got you covered when it comes to grocery shopping and cooking Hello, I am Tiff and my channel is Small Town 6 and over on my channel you can find lots of budget friendly grocery hauls, lots of budget friendly meals, things that your family will actually eat that are easy, cheap, and budget friendly because that's what I try to do all the time because I'm a mama of four so life is expensive, life is crazy with all the stuff going on and I just try to make it as simple as possible but you guys I would love to have you join my little family over here on YouTube I also have a second channel small town apparel for those that are into the crafting type of stuff and if you are in need of a sweatshirt t-shirt cups things like that I do custom apparel and I also have all kinds of other stuff that's already pre-printed um, but I do it all by hand so you guys can check that out it's um, smalltownapparelstore.com and you guys thank you so much for taking the time to watch and Jessie Christine from the bottom of my heart thank you you know I love you girl I've been following you for years huge fan so this is an awesome opportunity but you guys I appreciate it and I would love to have you come on over Okay, so now I have cleaned my sink. I have done all of the dishes. I'm just drying up these pots and pans that I washed by hand and putting them up. And I'm going to quickly wipe down my countertops. I'm just using my Mrs. Myers and the Daisy scent because that's another tip I have for you. Find a cleaning product that you enjoy, that something that smells good or something that you love the way it makes your counter shine when you are done. And use that because that will help motivate you to clean. I know smells motivate me. I am highly motivated by a good smelling clean product so I'm using my Mrs. May my Mrs. Maisie my Mrs. Myers Daisy scent today to help motivate me um, to wipe down the counters in the kitchen and I don't know about you but I have to wipe down the counters in my kitchen at least three times a day it's crazy how much like I and this and then somebody goes in there and makes a sandwich back. or snack I remember and they leave a mess and I was a teenager like, I've let me know if you've heard this song I just, before I always need my counters and my kitchen jamming out to it as well so I'm I hope that you guys are loving this music actually I know you are because I've had so many comments saying girl the music is fire I love the music I love it too. It's so much more fun to edit with it. So I am so excited that um, I have found a way that I can do that. And the way that I am able to do that is I actually have to pay for it. So I'm footing that bill for you guys because I think it makes it so much more fun and motivating. We're so limited in what we're able to use with copyrights and all of that. So I did find a loophole and that is basically I have to buy the license, but it's worth it because you guys are enjoying it. I love seeing the comments about you guys saying like how it got you up and got you moving and you love the music and you love the throwbacks to the 80s in the 90s so that makes it all worth it to me so go ahead and enjoy this next one some people say I look like me dad Boy. 
Okay, so in this power hour, I wanted to end with giving Tucker a bath. This was right before he got groomed. He actually got groomed a couple of days after this, but it always ends up he needs a bath right before that. It never fails. So I am giving him a quick bath in Hanky's shower here, and I'm just using this shower head that we bought from, I believe, like, I know you can get it on Chewy. Uh, you can get it on Amazon. I always have it linked in my like to know it if you are interested, but I highly recommend something like this. It's great for pets and kids. I use it to wash hair as well rinse out the soap and stuff but when it comes to pets as you can see it's super handy so I'm just giving him a quick bath and I am using baby shampoo I've used that on him for years and it works perfectly so he does not love bath time but he is such a good boy and does what he's supposed to so we're giving him a quick bath and then I had just enough time on the clock to wash the tub and wipe down the countertop as well And I'm not even kidding, right as I was finishing up wiping this out of the sink, my timer went off. I literally got it right on, I hit the nail right on the head, you guys. It was so awesome. Such a great feeling to know that I did it. And even if you don't meet the clock, that's okay. Don't be hard on yourself. If you're competitive like I am, don't be hard on yourself. You still got up and you still got so much done. And go ahead and finish whatever. It doesn't matter if it took you a little bit more than an hour. You know my power hours, they don't necessarily mean 60 minutes. They could mean anywhere from... 60 minutes to an hour and a half to two hours. It's just what you think is going to work for you. Set a timer and power through it, get it done. And you're going to be so proud of yourself when you're done. But thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope it motivated you. Don't click out just yet. Stay tuned for behind the scenes and I will see you in next week's video. Bye guys. A little controller for a remote for your car, huh? Yeah, it doesn't work. These batteries. I'll play my horses. I'll play my horses. You want to play the horses? Do my horses. That's a box. So horses. Oh, can, we, can Mommy have that? Thank you so much. I want horses. Okay, which horsey do you want? This one. Okay, here you go. You want this one too? Okay. Mommy's clearing the floor so I can vacuum. Move your head because you're in my frame. Move. 
Put my tripod alone. Ha ha ha! Can you go find mommy's phone for me? Yeah. I think I left it downstairs. Can you go look for it? Yeah. I don't find it. Well, you didn't go down and look for it. Or talk. I'm gonna give him the talk so he can roll on it. Come here, Tucker. You wanna roll on the towel? Help me. You got it. Put him in there. <laughs> Help me. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. You don't want to do it? Just set it right there on the floor. So I can hear when my timer goes off. Here, let me have my phone. Oh, there you go. Some people say I look like me, Dad. What?